Dev RTS. So the pregnant woman suffered from asymptomatic bacteria. As far as the baby is concerned, uh, infection may begin in labor and delivery and increase the yes. <laughs> You have been able to learn the critical health problems faced by mother and children and consider how health providers can make a difference. So let's begin. So our learning objectives are uh, first one is introduction, that is uh, what is maternal and child health, and then maternal health problems, maternal mortality indicators, child health problems, and child mortality indicators. So what is maternal and child health? So the term refers to mothers and children. It includes the sub areas of maternal health, child health, school training, school health, medical children, adolescents, and health aspects of children in special settings such as daycare. So, its specific, specific objectives are reduction of maternal perinatal impact and child mortality and mobility, promotion of reproductive health, and promotion of physical and psychological development of the child and adolescent within the family. Argument objective is lifelong health. So the currently the main health problems affecting the health of the mother and the child in India as in also in other developing countries include malnutrition, infection and consequences of unregulated pregnancy. Uh, furthermore, about 2 to 10 percent of pregnant women suffer from asymptomatic bacteria. As far as the baby is concerned, uh, infection may begin in labor and delivery and increase the and protect and maintain the health of the mother during pregnancy. 
paper shows the systolic blood pressure to be 140 millimeter mercury or more and further diastolic blood pressure to be 90 millimeter mercury or more. High blood pressure during pregnancy may signify Uh, with the help of partner. Now, moving on to 
the danger signals is the type of delivery. First of all, maternal signals, obstructed labor, stagnation, labor pain for more than 24 hours, bleeding during labor, convulsions, high temperature, at the same time not separated even after 30 weeks of delivery or collapse of the mother. If we see the fetal signs, including uh, uh, stain liquor, uh, sudden change in fetal heart rate that is less than 120 feet per minute or greater than 160 feet per minute. Collapse of the umbilical cord or hand. Now moving on to the